Hello everyone, thanks for coming back to the channel. Keep watching and I'll walk you through the process of buying web hosting from Bluehost. Hi everyone. Bluehost is our recommended web hosting partner, particularly for startups and small businesses. So I just want to walk you through the process of purchasing web hosting for your new website from Bluehost. So you start on this page and there's a link in the description. You start on this page, press the, clip, uh, the green bar here, get started now. You're going to see, uh, we're going to click through to three different options. So the basic uh, has just one website, limited web space, limit, uh, performance is standard. Uh, but you can see there's uh, not as many features and only 100 megabytes of storage. So there's also the plus package, which is a package that, that we had for a number of years. We still have actually, we've just, uh, we still have that package. We've had that package for about five, six years, marketingfundamentals.com. And there's the prime package. Be, please be aware, just a, a note of caution that obviously there's a, there's an offer on here, which is excellent. So 1099 reduced to 595 for the plus package. And I'm just going to run through the features in a moment. Prime package is also, uh, 595 at the moment, but, but look at this figure that's got a line through it. After one year, your monthly uh, hosting will go back up to 1499. And so perhaps plus is a better package for you because after one year, it'll just go to 10.99 per month. So it's just something to be aware of for year two. So the features for the plus package are unmetered website space, unmetered bandwidth, uh, park domains, unlimited subdomains, unlimited email accounts, unlimited. So this is a really good package and you get a number of marketing offers. So let's assume that we're not going to go for the 14.99, although obviously that might be the best package for some people. Uh, Let's assume that we are going to go for the plus package. We'll click here. I'm just clicking through now. And uh, we have it. Let's, uh, we've just bought our domain. So let's imagine it's bestdomain.com. Type that in. Click click through just clicking through now we need to enter our uh, name and address business details all of the usual uh, specifics and then pick our package information so our host our account plan we're going to go for two years so that would be 178.80 uh, setup is free search engine jumpstart we don't need that option site backup pro yeah, that's include. We're going to keep that included. Site lock, security find. No, we're not going to pick that option. So the total is two hundred fourteen dollars sixty eight, and that's for twenty four months. And then we're going to input our credit card details and click submit. Obviously, we should read the terms of service, cancellation, and privacy policy. And I mean that we actually should read them before we tick this box. Don't just tick it. Have a quick scan of those read them, digest. If there's anything that you're not happy with, uh, you can go into live chat with Bluehost and ask them about those particular policies or anything that you have a question mark over uh, and then click submit. Obviously, I've not filled out the details, so it won't let me submit. But let me just, while I've mentioned it, let me just uh, talk about live chat for a moment because live chat is 24 seven for Bluehost. So if you do have any issues, whether you're signed in as an actual customer or you're just uh, a prospect or, or a prospective customer, I should say, put in your name, your details, uh, and then what your inquiry relates to, and then click continue. I'm not going to do that because I don't have a problem. I don't have an issue that I want to discuss at the moment. So click continue and then you go into a live chat queue and it'll give you a countdown. Normally it's five, six, seven minutes perhaps, or it might be just a couple of minutes for you to wait. Uh, and then you'll get to ask uh, one of the customer service uh, staff your query if it relates to the sign up process or you have a technical 
question relating to moving you to your website or, or, or any capabilities of Bluehost thereof. So live chat is, is very useful 24 seven and it's open to people who aren't even yet customers of Bluehost. So that's, that's very useful. So we'll go back to the form. Well, let's imagine we've clicked out, we've, I've filled out the form. I've uh, filled out my credit card details and then submit and that's it. And then you are registered with Bluehost. When you've opened your, when you've registered for Bluehost, you've made payment for the hosting plan, your preferred hosting plan, you're going to be given access to a control panel. Control panel looks something like this. So you've got your hosting services, uh, and then there are a number of different categories. So there's a website here, website manager, installs, uh, themes and templates, email manager. So you can access emails there, set up new email accounts. You can also do it at the top screen navigation here, email. So you'll be using that quite a lot. Uh, what else is in here that's used? Domain manager is used quite regularly. You need to have access to that. Files, um, statistics, although then AW stats is not superior to Google Analytics. So you should still use your Google Analytics. But it's interesting to have a look at AW stats and Webalizer stats and compare them to Google Analytics. They're not comparing directly like with like. So it's not um, an exact synergy there between the data that's being collected, but it's still interesting to look at nevertheless. If you want to upgrade, you can do so via this segment. Uh, and that's really all of the key uh, security and just scrolling down for you so you can have a look at the control panel before you've actually signed up. But those are the key sections for Bluehost web hosting and this is the control panel. So I hope that's been useful to you. Thanks very much for watching uh, all the way through. Uh, I look forward to speaking to you in the next video. If you like this video, please subscribe. If you want to watch more videos, click on the picture from a video. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.